Sebastian Ben Martinez, MMA Net. We're here with Sultan Aliyev, who makes his UFC debut against Kenny Robertson at UFC on Fox 14 here in Stockholm, Sweden. Uh, Sultan, I know it's been a long time coming. I'm sure many have been looking forward to your UFC debut, and now you're doing it at the biggest European MMA show ever. How does that feel? Uh, I'm very happy and pleased to uh, be here in the UFC that they signed me, that they gave me the opportunity to fight in the best organization. And uh, more, more pleasant that uh, I'm here in Europe fighting not far from my home, from uh, Russia, so our people can watch it. Uh, actually, right now they're streaming on the Russian television. I'm happy for that, like in a double. So I'll, I'll do my best. I'll try to do the best work in the cage. A lot of people usually talk about the so-called UFC jitters, that uh, you can be very experienced, but when you debut in the UFC, you still feel a little, little bit like you're new because it's so big. And now we're here, it's going to be maybe 30, 35,000 people. Have you thought about maybe feeling a little bit nervous for this fight? Uh, usually when I walk to the octagon or cage, or any ringside, there is nothing between me and my opponents and uh, I'm concentrated only on the fight. So at this time I'll try to do the same. All right, well let's look at your opponent a little bit. You're facing Kenny Robertson who has uh, quite a bit of experience in the UFC. He's had quite a few nice submission wins. What do you, how do you see him as an opponent and where do you think he's most dangerous? Well, uh, I think uh, I think I can uh, uh, fight with him anywhere in the stand-up, on the ground game. His uh, background is a wrestling, so I'm a wrestler too. I have a re very good uh, wrestling skills, especially uh, from Dagestan, where I'm from. It's a good skills back down there. So I'll take the fight anywhere where it takes place. Yeah, like you said, uh, good wrestling background and from Dagestan. We've seen so many fighters come out from sort of uh, Dagestan, about close by region. Why is it that there are so many Dagestani fighters that are not just successful in MMA but in the UFC? Uh, well, uh, generally in Dagestan, all the guys they are in, in any sports. There is actually like a kind of cult of uh, martial arts. So everyone since the childhood uh, wants to be like a wrestler or like Olympic champion. But now when the MMA is become uh, more popular, our guys uh, are from Dagestan guys. They switch. They uh, convert from their uh, background sport to the MMA, and I think that's the reason. So we got a lot of talented guys. They come and they will come in the future as well. Well, yeah, obviously a lot of talented guys like the one in front of me. So just to round off here. What are your predictions for the fight? How do you think it will end? Uh, I'm preparing to fight all three rounds, but if I'll see any opportunity, any chance to finish the fight early, I'll do it. All right. Well, we're very much looking forward to you, Sultan. Thank you very much.